Hi Scorpio, welcome to my channel. This is your love romantic relationship reading for um for the period of February 18 up until the 24th of February 2019. This is a love romantic relationship reading for you applicable for singles, couples in a relationship or dating. Um before I start, I want to thank you for your support, for your likes. Um, for the positive comment that you put on the community um, community post. And I want to welcome those new subscribers that click subscribe this week. So th welcome to my channel. Welcome to my family here in YouTube. Welcome on board. And may I just remind everyone to click the notification bell. So just so this will notify you in a real time when, when I upload the video. Okay? So, that's my introduction. Sorry, it's a bit long. This is for Scorpio sign for 18th up until the 24th of Feb for my Scorpio. This is for Scorpio sign 18th to February 24, 2000, 2019. Messages, please, for my fellow Scorpio. Wow, the lover's card choosing the lovers choosing love all right the two of pentacles in reverse so it means this is you know slowing down this is slowing down this is you know leaving one responsibility behind and choosing to prioritize the other responsibility so this is this is a choice this is slowing down and the choice is related to the lovers you might be dealing with a gemini but you're choosing to love you're accepting love you're choosing you know in in a general one in a general collective this is soulmate connection this is a strong connection this is because this is you know two person loving each other mutually so there's love around you there's a person around you who's gonna choose you who's gonna choose love you're gonna choose to be with you all right could be a mutual decision it could be an individual decision but this is choosing love and i as i said choosing love this card pop up so this is six of cups this is soulmate connection this person is someone probably in your past or you know this person or it could it could be that you know this person is um is someone that you're married or in in a relationship with a long time because this is memory lane uh, the person with um with somehow gives you um a homey feel a home a home feeling like that and it has the you know it also speaks about children you know um childhood so you're choosing love all right your you know your your memories of love and connection i'm getting like memories i'm getting soulmate connection i'm getting messages that you know you'll this time you'll prioritize this person or someone is gonna prioritize you they're gonna choose you it's a soulmate connection the connection is um has been renewed could be that you're reconnecting or if this is a new person um it's a new person but it feels old like you've known each other for a long time like it's strong something like that and i'm gonna get, i'm gonna get more message but you know it's a good start scorpio it's a good start um you got the knight of pentacles in reverse so this is you know this is what i've mentioned to you if you look at this card you know, this is in reverse. Two of pentacles in reverse. So you're dropping one responsibility. And the other responsibility, you know, that, that is this coin. That is this knight of pentacles. It's showing reverse because I felt like it's it's a, it's a recent decision. It's a recent decision to, you're juggling two things. It could be work and career. And finally, you've realized, okay, I'm just going to slow down at career and probably, you know, look after myself, the person I'm dating, um, in my family, the, you know, the, my girlfriend, my boyfriend, you know, it's time to, you know, to focus on them because the Knight of pentacles, you know, this is having issue with commitment, but I felt like you have identified that, um, someone has identified that they've been, um, that they have been um, not really giving lots of effort and time and committing well to you, Scorpio. So that's been identified by someone. So they're going to make a decision to prioritize you. 
I'll probably put that in the title. And I felt like it's gonna make you happy. I felt like you know having the six of cups here. It's part. It's 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 restoration of your faith memories. It's it's new, but it's feeling old school. If you're reconnecting, for some of you, if you're still married, if you're still in a relationship, this is this is like going back to how you were before, because someone is gonna make a choice to you know, to properly commit by putting more effort, exerting more effort, okay? I'm just gonna write down something. What was that I'm supposed to write about the title? Oh, never mind. I'll just replay the video. So it's a good start. It's really a good reading. It's like um, someone realizing that they made a mistake, that they have set aside you, and it's now time to come back. It's now time to come home. All right, that's a good title. It's time to come home, baby. Um, okay, so let's get more cards, please, universe. What other message can you say? All right, again, another homey card, Queen of Pentacles. So someone is going to be caring. This is a maternal card. So you could be reconnecting to a person that has that you have you know children that you have kids or if you didn't separate physically um you could still be together living at the same house but this time you're more focused on you know on making the family making the bond of the family stronger by taking care of each other um prioritizing your your family over work or friends or any external factors and you'll prioritize you know while you build up the relationship again you know build the relationship back the way it used to be you are also focusing on taking care of the kids or if you don't have kids yet this means that this is not just a connection. This is not just a typical love. But there is also an essence here where someone is ready to be a mother, more family-oriented. Or if that's that's not the case, there's, there's someone here who is very, very caring. This time, they will care. All right? I'm getting a message that this time, they don't just want to be with you and have a relationship with you. They, they want a caring, caring relationship. Someone that's care. Someone that... Oh, there's a person here who's in a queen of pentacles, someone who's willing to give it all, you know, to give all their effort and time to make it work. Because the queen of pentacles, you know, it's a motherly energy, you know, our mom, you know, even though they have, you know, one dollar left in their pocket, they will, you know, they will give it to you. Then, you know, it's like it's, it's you know, the nature of the mother, you know. If there's a food in the kitchen and you're hungry, they will give give it all to you. It it doesn't matter whether whether they will eat, but they will you know they will ha they'll give it all to you. That you know that the that caring nature that I sense in here, um, that someone is willing to do that sacrifice. All right, I'm sorry for the bad example, but it's more of yeah you know it, it will sacrifice what, what you know. Even there's little time left for themselves, they will sacrifice it to give it to this relationship, to this relationship. So it's really powerful because there's two people here trying to mend, to mend, and put effort to make it work. All right. If this is just dating, then you are looking at a relationship where, or a dating where it was not okay before, but now they're more committed because you've got the soulmate connection, and this is a person where. You could say you could grow old together because it, it's not just bound by love, but a sincere care. All right. Last two cards, please, for Scorpio. Queen of Cups. And you've got the judgment. So I felt like the judgment in here is um, something to something to remind you that, you know, this is your plan. This is currently what you feel because it feels brand new you know when you when you just met someone you're all over them so this i think is a card where it should remind you that you know this is a beginning phase 
where everything feels brand new and you know shiny and um you're all pumped up so you need to maintain this kind of um, momentum feelings because if you don't then whatever plan and connection you've got at the moment which is really really good it might not be it might not well let's more let's put it on a more positive way that this this start is something sincere and genuine for the two of you okay because someone is willing to make an effort so keep this momentum to avoid this re this judgment in reverse and the Queen of Cups in reverse. Because this simply, this, this two cards is kind of an indication, a reminder that, you know, um, you have them right now. You have their attention. You both are at the same page, same maturity, same feelings. So you better take care of this. All right. So this is, you know, this is this, the this is what the two cards cuz this is a strong base, okay? This is a strong foundation. Very strong that um if you don't take care of this like any other relationship, then it will, you know, it might it might drive it might go into a passive kind of relationship again where there's no love. It was it's just a flat line. So that this is, I guess, what the two cards in here is to keep the momentum, take care of the relationship so that you wouldn't have you wouldn't have any worries in the future. All right. I know there are times that it's not gonna be perfect, but at you know, at, at if you could contain this kind of love relationship, make time, then there is nothing really to worry in the future. Even if you do have a problem. If you have a good foundation, if you have laid down, you know, a trust, a good foundation and a good memories, you know, it's, it's, it's something to make the relationship strengthen. Then there's no way a bad issue can turn this down, right? A good foundation is always, you know, the best, um, the best source of strength to keep the relationship intact, all right? So this is for you, Scorpio. It's it's really a good reading. I felt like it's it's not just a, a weekly reading, but this this foundation or energy. I felt like it start this week. So good luck to you. May you enjoy this relationship or connection. Like what I said, take care, take care of this momentum. You take advantage of this momentum because you're both aligned. The energy in here, okay, in the in the bottom of the deck is the Ace of Cups. So there's a lot of love. There is a lot of love. So thank you, Scorpio. I'll see you soon again. Bye-bye.